So the guy with the bolts in his throat, he does manage to yell out something. Really? <laughs> yep. Really? Yes. Oh. Crazy out here. Yeah. God damn it. And uh, he pulls out his uh, crossbow again and fires it at you, Wolfgar, for a 19 Jeez. to hit. Oh, that actually will hit. That is my AC. Yeah, it actually just goes out there cheating. Ty hits, right? Yeah. Yeah. Alright. Oh, I should have stabbed him. You yep. should have, yeah. You're busy. No, the, the lightning bolt was huge. <laughs> the lightning okay. bolt was way better. Trinity actually did try to stab him it. and didn't manage. Yeah. You don't need that's that's okay. uh, How does that have to start? Because my lover was under attack. Yeah, so so that you sounds abandoned. just like you. We're not gonna go into this right now. <laughs> I abandoned you all. I, I, I just and like to imagine that this conversation is happening as we're fighting. Yeah. <laughs> like Pirates of the Caribbean, we're just yeah. having full blown conversations <laughs> in the middle of a fight. He is still here. What an idiot. Yeah. I uh, told you. This guy also, uh, he is invisible by the time that he shoots. As soon as he shoots, he turns visible. The visible, but he is also going to shoot you. Visible. The visible. Visible. Uh, high. 25 to hit. Okay. Uh, that misses it? No. <laughs> I wish that missed. This is not good, guys. I'm sorry. It'll be our turns eventually, and we'll do something to help. Yeah. yeah. We'll have to. <laughs> 22 points of damage. Oh my god. Right, I am unconscious. You're unconscious? Yeah. Oh. Uh -huh. It's about time, honestly. <laughs> I mean, you're, you're buff, but damn. Yeah, I was gonna lay hands, but I did not know that, that guy was going to come out of nowhere and shoot me also. Before um, I got to, you know, do that to myself. Before I got to touch myself. <laughs> I can touch myself. Wait, can I touch you? No, I think I've been only touch myself. <laughs> I can touch you. <laughs> I love it. Can I touch you? No, I think I can only touch myself. <laughs> yeah, I'm just gonna <laughs> Uh, three yeah. times? Three, three times my monk. Yeah. I don't think it was my bubble. Passive perceptions for everyone? Um, 16. It's 10 plus your perception. Mm -hmm. We're looking for sure. 11. 14. There it is. Oh, uh, yeah, that's 10. 10. I'm insightful. I'm not perceptive. Mm -hmm. Wait, that guy disappeared again? Uh, you saw him... Actually, I'm gonna say... And you saw him move this way. I saw that. And then he disappeared. What a fool. Yeah. Uh, and this guy is going to... Use a bonus action to disengage. And then start running this way. What a limo. How far? Uh, 25 feet. Okay. How long can I go? <laughs> Amadine, your turn. Finish. Shoot him! Shoot him! <laughs> Kill him! Shoot him! Kill him! Finish him! The girl. I mean, I'm standing there with my bow and arrow, and well, I just shot one guy. Well, you have to actually get outside. Yeah, it's not a problem. Are people in my way? Okay. Yeah, yeah. Well, but you just can see our trinity's her. in your way. Yeah, yeah. Well, yeah but I, I'm, a, I'm a ducker and a diver and a weaver and a dodger. I'm just going to swoop so on under like and get a shot. Yeah, yeah. 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 Yeah,
<laughs> and the momentum was pretty good. Yeah. And the yeah, the electrical impulse was still taking his legs forward. I could chicken with its head cut off. <laughs> yeah. Alright, fair enough. Uh okay. Next up. Invisible Monty. Yeah, Monty has three hit points left, so Monty's staying inside where Monty right. can lick his wounds until I can come and heal him. It's fine. Okay. Uh, Devenna. Uh, can I see else. any or hear any bad guys? <laughs> Make a perception check. Is this with disadvantage? No. Okay. So that's not good anyway, so that's <laughs> eight. Not see or hear any bad guys. Cool. There's no bad guys around, guys. Cool. Um, I'm gonna go up to Ulfgar. Yeah. I'll give you some hit yeah. points. I don't remember. That's enough. To get I just don't know if I'm gonna give you all of them or if I have. Don't. To. You can just give me stable, man. I can take care of the rest. Mm -hmm. At least. Yeah. A good I'm handful of them. Yeah. So six. You get six hit points. I had to walk over to him technically, but are we still in initiative? Still in initiative. Cool. So in this case, to stable up, like stay, it's my health, my exact hit points is six, yes. right? Okay. Just checking because you know this thing has the stabilized the first. One, and yeah, then. it's weird. Uh, okay, I'm stable. I don't okay. want to save it anymore. Uh, Kithri, your point? turn. Um, what's around me? What kind of enemies do we have? Go and make a perception check. We can't feed him, right? <laughs> uh, Fourteen. Uh, you don't see or hear anyone around you. Uh, Trinity, your turn. I was never aware that there was an invisible guy around me. Perception check, I think. You well, he appeared he here. He just he's me. looking the other way. Mm -hmm. True. Uh, I might have heard when your lover went down from that arrow. I heard her go down, but I or him go down. But I don't know <coughs> that um, I'm gonna go and see. Can I go and check out the body of that guy? Uh, sure. Let's start so you move people. over to the body. Uh, We'll get there next. Uh, Ulfgar, your turn. Okay, I will come back to consciousness. <laughs> well, I am technically. Four years. Oh, I guess technically you're prone. Mm. Yeah. Um, so I can lay on hands for 30. I have the weakest one of those killing things of all of us. Show me my counters. No. Show me. You can lay on hands for more than I told you. Maybe it's just 25. Okay, so I'll no. that. And it should be 30. Is your okay. Yeah. Sorry. Maybe, oh, I bet I didn't update my counter in the spell app when I leveled boss. Okay, so then once I'm healed, I will get up, okay. which will be half my, well, not half my movement, but will take a bit. And then I would like to kind of survey and see if I like see or hear anything if I can. Okay. Uh, so that's. Or is that too much? That's. That's too, too much. much. So this yeah. is an active yeah. perception check. That would be an action. Yeah, uh, uh, that's fine. I'll, I'll just be up and okay, up and alert <laughs> and there. Uh, Vilgrath, your turn. Uh, I say there was a guy around the corner. So 10, 20, 30, probably past it at this point. Uh, yeah, you are. Thirty-five, forty-five. Uh, uh, yeah, yeah, forty-five. Uh, at this point, you do see a dwarf fighting right here. Mm -hmm. 
Okay. So, so I get my I get my three. You just have a I get my three right. <laughs> so again, gray die is the unarmed. Okay, so the uh, nineteen and twenty are the quarter staff, and then fifteen for the unarmed. All of them hit. No. So five plus five plus four, so fourteen already. It's a good idea. Yeah, yeah you finish him off. Yeah. But we need to know by how much. <laughs> <laughs> how much exactly does he smash him in the ground? Yeah. I mean, is it gruesome? And probably by the second hit. He's so the third dead. punch is just useless. Well, uh, so yeah, the first hit was ten. The second hit was ten, and the, the third hit was eight. Okay. We killed him. Yeah, but Tarantino. Just yeah. an FYI, also, you do have to announce it beforehand, but since we're early in the campaign, uh, if you wanted to keep him alive, you can do so. Ah. If you wanted to keep him alive, you can do so. Yes. Yeah. I I was I was thinking this guy, but that guy kind of went down. Yeah. Um, Everyone was screaming, shoot him. I got, I just, I did it. <laughs> yeah. did it. Shoot him! Uh, so it not. does depend. Uh, ranged attacks, they're a little bit harder to control. I might make you roll for it. He's in melee. Yeah, I got oh here. no, I was intending to I'm kill him. I'm not cutting anything, it's all bludgeoning. Just oh, there, there's nothing just to hit him in the face, knock I him out. I was shooting to kill. He didn't shoot him, I was going to stab him. Hit him in the face, knock him out. So he goes unconscious. <laughs> he doesn't even do magic. Like, no. um, what are you talking about? I just it's shot no a choice. lightning bolt. Shot and and not by, you didn't she's, just, she's more straight than you would imagine a magician. Kendry's hood, man. She's yeah. from the she's from the ghetto of Hobbit. I'm a magician. I'm a you're With a that, wizard. Wait, what? <laughs> we will take our break. Coming back to our adventure, uh, the group just finished off a little skirmish there. Wolfgar went down momentarily, die. but he didn't die. That's what we strive to do every day, not die. Yep. Okay, uh, what do you want to do next? What, isn't there one of these guys no, still left around? We got an unconscious guy. We'll have a talk with that one. Yeah. Uh, the the I was going to inspect the dead guy. I mean, we do have the room for the night. We do have the room for the night. <laughs> call Thorbio back. We can take him to the room <laughs> is what I meant, but sure, you can call Thorbio back. <laughs> so you gather him up and start to head inside? Um, yeah, I guess so. Okay. That's not suspicious. Yeah. As, as you're <laughs> gathering him up, uh, Several of the city guard uh, converge on the area and they say, we heard a disturbance and they see uh, scorch marks from lightning blasts. The ground, the stonework (laughs) ground is ruptured up and they're like, what happened here? Uh, We were attacked. Uh, They look over you and say, hmm. You're... Drake Hart, right? Yes. Do you want to report this? Do you want? Do you need medical attention? No, I'm I'm okay. I think Monty does. Monty oh, does. Monty I, does. I, I healed some, yeah. but if there's an opportunity for that, her, her <laughs> mastiff does need some healing. Uh, exactly. Who looks you? over at it? I think they're city guard. You should city probably guard. take him to a vet or something, <laughs> and <laughs> continues talking. Very about helpful. Her. Thank you. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Who, and uh, have you guys already taken the Dorgar inside yet? Yes. I mean, we were planning to. I don't know how long it took yeah. them to get there. Uh, and you could have gotten him inside by then. Okay. And so we can like so. There's the other bodies that are actually dead that are uh, lying in the street. Yeah. yeah like the dead are you looking through things? the pockets of various bodies? Uh, I just want to see if there's anything that might indicate uh, who sent these people. Sure. Uh, investigation check. Nice. You're doing that mm-hmm. while the guards are coming because you wanted to go to that body to begin with. I wanted to tie Net the 20. unconscious guy. <laughs> yes. Good job. That's what I'll do. It's 29. How much do I know about BDSM and can I tie this guy to look like he's into it? Since we're going into a brothel. Uh... <laughs> 
I'd say you know nothing about BDSM. <laughs> Fair enough. Boo. Librarians are not. Boo. I grew up on the street. You know. I don't. I can't think of a situation where you would have learned that. Yeah. Fair no. enough. Not a good one. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Not a mug. Yeah. I will still tie him up though. <laughs> okay. I mean, you could just do the basic wrist ties to the you know what? post. Kip Everyone's into that. Yeah. <laughs> if anyone knew, if he gets anyone knew, knew he get the get the get some kinky ass shit. I called K three over and be like, "Can we make this look like some sort of sexual thing?" Sure. <laughs> sure. Uh, but with this sort of planning out and tying him up. That would take time. It takes a lot of more time. Yeah. The time. Well, but they're going inside the building. Okay. Those are taller than I tie up the hands together, and then I'm assuming you're like basically carrying him. Okay. Maybe dragging. I can't, but whatever. I've got a 12 string. And then, <laughs> then I'll call K3 up as we're okay. walking. Like, that's the plan. All right. Uh, so with a natural Sorry. 20 on investigation, and you look through uh, this dwarf's things, and you immediately recognize that this is another another rogue. Uh, they have pockets that contain useful items like lock picks and uh, caltrops and extra coins stashed away everywhere in case they need money in an, an emergency. Uh, you find two uh, poison flasks of the same type that he threw at you. I'll show you those later. Uh, you find... I'm taking those, by the way. Yeah. Okay. Uh, you find a pouch uh, that has, interestingly, uh, an even number, exactly 100 gold coins in it. Uh, as you'll eventually see that there's a hundred in there, but uh, as you look through the coins, you actually also notice that they're branded with a city and insignia that you're not familiar with at all. Um, and you also find... What was the city name? You said you're not familiar, not familiar with, with it. Yeah. But like, what? what, what I don't, I don't Can you know make out what it says? What it says? Uh, is it sorry, it, it doesn't actually have the name on oh, it. Oh, it's sort of like a okay. brand. Yeah. Okay. Uh, you find I, his crossbow is still intact. Bolts are still intact. Uh, he has a short sword on his belt. Uh, you don't find any sort of papers or documentation or anything that really would give any other clues. By the way, unless you guys tell me you're putting something in the bag of holding, I'm not adding it to it. <laughs> okay. Um, and the, the other bodies kind of fell underneath the ground, right? No. Oh, the other bodies are there. on the street still. Yeah. I'm heading over to the body that has gonna, my arrow in it. I'm going to check all of them. <laughs> I like collecting my arrows. That's the one he's at. Well, he's been at it forever. Okay. <laughs> he also had a nap I'm just saying, like maybe in the time that he was checking the other body, do I get at least a chance to go to the first one? And you can both look <laughs> over together. And I don't want to. Investigation check. <laughs> if you want to look for other things. Uh, yeah, I'm grabbing my arrow and I'm doing an investigation check. Uh, 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 16. Okay. Uh, What's that funny? Pretty much as soon as... Because you had to subtract one. <laughs> oh. <laughs> yes, I'm not very smart. <laughs> uh, you go over to the body while Trinity is there as well, and pretty much as soon as you're about to uh, look for a pocket, Trinity's already pulled something out of it, and basically you don't find anything else. Uh, you do manage to retrieve your arrow. But you want to look at other bodies? No, 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 that's fine. Walk away. There are other bodies there. I'm going to look at the other bodies. Okay. Around this time, the guards do come and get there. That's fine. Still going to keep doing it. All right. Uh, we'll keep your same investigation check. Same with you. Um, by the, Before the guards sort of interrupt you, uh, you manage to pretty much figure out that these guys probably don't carry any sort of 
notes or identifying information on them. Mm -hmm. uh, you do find uh, between the other bodies uh, another, probably just get one more pouch, another 50 gold. Same coins. Uh, guards come and they start asking Ulfgar all these questions and they kind of look over at the bodies in the seat. Holy shit! Are those Dorgar? What I know that they're yes, you know. Oh, yes, yes, they are. Uh, how the fuck do they get in the city? I have no idea. It's a very good question. Uh, we have to report this right away. And uh, he talks to one of his companions, and they go and run off. Uh, all right. Uh, you guys have made it inside. They they're talking to Ulfgar. Outside, you can probably tie him up without being noticed. Going up to the room. I'm just gonna ask Okar if he's okay. Yeah, I'm alright. Glad to hear Are you him. okay? Yeah, I'm fine. I didn't get hit. I mean, I can try to help you carry this guy up the stairs. <laughs> the two weakest thing. people just as, like dragging the body. <laughs> as you're dragging him up, there, there are people uh, looking oh, outside wow, the room. Right. in various states of undress and uh, trying to sort of see what all the commotion is. Oh yeah, because it probably just sounded like a big fight. Yeah. yeah. It's pretty bad. Just got really drunk. It's good. I just keep tracking. Alright. As Mine's I'd, also eight, by the way. Mm. Uh, you drag him up to the room. Uh, the guards continue questioning and some of the uh, basically the the matron, yeah, the matron uh, comes out and asks you what happened, uh, starts speaking with the guards as well, uh, says that there was someone who dragged a body into the inn and up to a room. And uh, the guards ask, uh, is, is this a household manor? Is this something that uh, we need to concern ourselves with? The... Drugar? Durgar. Durgar? Mm -hmm. Not that I'm aware of, but this is the first time seeing them in the city, so... I don't know what this is about more than you do. Alright, then... Okay. Uh, they sort of walk past you and go into uh, the brothel and continue up the stairs and uh, you probably have only maybe 30 seconds to a minute with the door guard before the guards start into the room. Oh, they know what room we're in? Uh, the matron came out. And, cool. Yeah. Hi! I'm gonna follow them. Okay. Yeah, I'm okay. two at that point. I'm downstairs, but my dog is bleeding. Alright. Uh, Can I help ooh. you? Who sent you? With a quarterstaff to his face. Oh god. So, you're saying this to the guard? No, yes. no, oh, I thought we have 30 seconds with the guy yeah, before. Yeah, that's what I was saying. Oh, I thought it was the guard We, we have th We have 30 seconds to talk to this guy before the guards get there. Well, he's still unconscious. One, right? he is unconscious. Oh, uh, never mind. Yeah. Uh, oh, okay. Well, but we hear the footsteps? Uh, you... Yeah, you hear that someone's probably coming in the end. Can we shove him under the bed and pretend like I'm unconscious? Sure. <laughs> I like it. And, like, pretend like you're dragging me. This is the most exciting <laughs> thing we've seen you do, Belker. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, so you hide him, uh, and you pretend to be unconscious? Yeah. And I'll, I'll be over you being like, hey, hey, wake up, man. Hey. You good? Yeah. Things got a little intense there for a minute. What happened? Is guards here yet? Yeah. <laughs> Guard, guards come in, they say, where's the door guard? The what? The gray dwarf. Where is he? We don't have a gray dwarf. Gray dwarf. Oh, dwarves are not gray. 
I'm a halfling. <laughs> the matron told us that someone came and dragged up a gray dwarf here. Are you sure it was? Are they here, there yet? Mm-mm. -mm. Deception check. I don't know why we're trying to just. I'm not there them. yet. You got it. I mean, I'd say we get there like uh, right. Not unless you had a reason to follow the guard up. Oh, I said I followed him up. Oh, okay. I was gonna yeah. follow, but yeah. not like 21. super on their tail. Twenty-one. Mm -hmm. Uh, so and yeah, you you guys are there right now. Yeah. Okay. I walk in and I'm like, I see that the door guard's not there, and I see you, and I'm like, oh. and like internally, I'm just like, okay. Yeah, but I thought I'd see you. They said something about a gray dwarf. Oh, yeah. They know that we fought the Urgars outside. Okay. But is, is that, that what those are? Yeah, those are gray dwarves. Oh. Yeah. They're outside. <sighs> Must be a different room or something. I don't know. Uh, stay here. Don't leave. I wasn't planning on it. Uh, walks down the hall and knocks on their door. Uh, they open immediately and he, they start talking with uh, the guard there. What are you guys doing? Immediately message to um, my buddy here and be like, what do you want us to do? Shoved him under the bed. <laughs> Honestly, I have no clue. I mean, do you want them to know where it is? I guess. Well, I mean... You're the target, so... Yeah, I mean, I guess so, because if they're going to conduct an investigation... I know I can't say all this to you, but I'll probably just, like, well, answer you in a message a few times. Yeah. Well, cool. Um, I want to, uh... I, I would probably make myself clear that we should not let, let them take this thing. Well, we're, this is all in the, our heads. I know what I'm saying. I would make that clear that that's why I followed them up. How would you make that clear? I'm just, I'm, I'm, I have no intention of letting that thing go out. Mm. Well, we walk over to under the bed and start to pull it out. Okay. Yeah. And then that, I will stop you okay. and shove it back in and I'll say, we need to get to this before anyone else because we're the only people that we can trust. Some water for you. Of course, I suggest maybe you pull your family car and get them out of here. This is water! Okay. I mean, I assume there's water, yeah, yeah. ale, or something in the room. And so Perfume. I'm gonna play the I'm still dealing with my drunk, unconscious friend here. <laughs> you got okay. It's not me, this time. Uh, Can you play drunk, though? That's the question. <laughs> I'm not playing drunk, I'm playing I just got hurt in combat. We told everyone you were drunk. <laughs> <laughs> I was drunk? Okay. Okay. <laughs> the worst person. <laughs> <laughs> the only person who doesn't know what it's like to be drunk. <laughs> it's gonna be like a 13 year old. The one that was I've on been hand, knocked guys. out before. I know what it's so. like to be like, uh, Greg, if you just keep out. making the right what decisions, don't we? Have you seen drunk before? Collectively, I have seen drunk. people be drunk before. <laughs> just Nick <laughs> Kithri. If they. If we had a wisdom score as a group, it's got to be low. It's got to be. <laughs> but my actual wisdom is not very high. <laughs> Both we're, ours we're, is. We're, we're the two with the wisdom. <laughs> yeah. Mine's decent. Uh, 16. Oh, yeah. You're good. That's not bad. Okay, Mine's wisdom. Non wisdom. It's the only reason my perception or in, what insight checks do so well. I'm intelligent. I'm just not wise. 